Do 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 do. Damn, there's already one person watching. I just started. Wow, you're fast. Hey, what up, guys? John from Magic Tech Review. I'm here on the Octel Idol 4 shooting my uh, video here, and yeah. So we're gonna go ahead and talk about, uh, you know, basically what you can afford versus flagships, MV. You know what I'm saying? Watching, look, looking at people with the Galaxy S8 and iPhone 7 and, you know, all these other big flagships. And, you know what I'm saying? Should you be jealous? Should you care? Does it really matter? You know what I'm saying? If you're happy with what you have and, you know, you're not some super tech wizard that needs to work off their phone every day and just needs to get phone calls, texts, play a game or two, you know what I'm saying? Is it okay to just... Is it okay to just use any phone you have you know what I'm saying do you need the highest flagship phone do you need these things Gabriel Kriya Gabriel what's up what's up hey John uh, M does tech what's up so yeah so hey love your videos thank you Jeremiah ZT is good for me right now Ray Hernandez what's up what's up uh, yeah absolutely man um, I just I see people come in and guys leave likes as, as you come on in thank you so much for that uh, if you're watching this on the replay please leave a thumbs up leave a meaningful comment but uh, as far as the live chat welcome everyone so yeah guys I'm gonna have to read your comments off of uh, my other phone can't read them off the screen right now but yeah so I figured I'd use the Octal Idol 4 because it's a little bit better as far as quality wise the picture or whatever to me at least and it doesn't go in and out um, but yeah so guys um, you know what I'm saying I don't really, I just use my phone for calling, texting, social networking, and sometimes Skype. Yeah, so, I mean, guys, you you know what I'm saying? If if you really don't have, if you really don't need your phone to be like all that or whatever, and it doesn't need to be, you know what I'm saying, the highest spec thing in the world, you know, you don't need octa-core or deca-core or 20-core processors and, you know what I'm saying, 10, uh, 1080p or 2K resolution or 4K resolution which I don't think they have any phones yet. They might have one or two phones out there in the wild that actually have a 4K resolution or they're coming up with one. You know what I'm saying? You don't really need that, guys. If, if You know what I'm saying? Nowadays, touch screens are pretty much good. Uh, you know what I'm saying? You can even go into, um, you know, you know, Walmart, Family Dollar, or whatever, pick up a 5-inch device and, you know, just go right at it. You know what I'm saying? It doesn't really... It's Android, Android right now is getting to a point that pretty much every... Now, I'm not going to say every single phone you get, but most phones you get will be able to handle what you can throw at them. You know what I'm saying? They're, most of them are quad core, at least clocked at 1, 1 1.1, 1 1.2, 1 1.3, 1 1.4 gigahertz. Um, you already know I got to go for the S8. Uh, Quinter, uh, Quinterius Bird. Absolutely, absolutely. Uh, let me see here. So, yeah, I mean, and I understand. I understand, guys. Like, there's some people that... You know what I'm saying? They live on their phone. They they live on their phone. They breathe on their phone. They work from their phone. Their phone actually requires, or their job, or their livelihood, or whatever they do in their life, actually requires them to be, you know, to have very nice flagship devices. Then you know what I'm saying? Hey, if that's what you need, you know what I'm saying? And you're in the market for it. You have the money. Go ahead and spend it. I'm talking about the people. I'm talking about the people that, you know, what I'm saying that you really don't need that stuff. You know, you know, you're you're fine with. Uh, with whatever you know, whatever you can afford, and um, I want people to know that it's okay if you don't, you know, what I'm saying if you don't need these flagship de devices, that you don't need to feel bad, you don't need to have phone envy, you know, what I'm saying because people, you know, those people, um, you know, they're they're in a different position, you know, they make they're making money off their stuff, they're you know, what I'm saying they're using their phone for whatever the case may be, or maybe their moms and dads are buying it for them, you know, what I'm saying, and their moms and dads have uh you know they they work a lot you know what i'm saying they they work a lot and they make money so that's what it is you know what i'm saying uh one day you know when you have a really good job or whatever uh you know then you can afford those those things but don't put yourself into a predicament get loans you know what i'm saying and all this other stuff just because of a silly device you know what i'm saying i mean what are you going to do like live out in the street um you know because because you wanted the galaxy s8 or or g6 or you know what I'm saying, or whatever other phone there is out there that that falls into that category. Oh, 17 people watching. It says, "Wow, uh, damn." So I'm only seeing nine up here, but I guess it's 17. That's dope. That's dope. Thank you guys. 
Um, let me see. I have the ZT Grand X3, and I love it. It works for me. Absolutely. See, ZT Grand X3 is a good phone. ZT Grand X4 is a better phone. Ten ten dollars more or whatever. But if you had the ZT Grand X3 and it works for you, then absolutely. You know what I'm saying? If I had to use the ZT Grand X3, I would use it. Absolutely, I would use it. You know what I'm saying? I I tend to try to get a little bit above, but that's because I work at the phone store and I can like. You know what I'm saying? I can work around things and I can buy phones off of other people and, you know what I'm saying, stuff like that, you know? But I don't buy my phones at full price. I can't. Uh, uh, Roy Fern says, hey, John, love your vids, man. Keep up the, the work. Cricket Wireless customer already two years and I love it, bro. Let them know about the Moto G5 Plus best budget phone in the market. Yeah, there you go. And, you know what I'm saying? And everybody has their little go-to go -to device, you know what I'm saying, that you can get an unlocked phone. So nowadays... You can get an unlocked phone for, you know what I'm saying, if you do want to spend that $250, $200, $300, you know what I'm saying, and then you know you're going to keep a certain device for a while, then that's good as well. Uh, let me see. That was so real to say. Much respect, bro. Yeah, Philly, 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 I can't say your smokes, smokes. Uh, I can't really say your last name, but uh, yeah, man, you know what I'm saying? Like Little John, he's actually using the ZT Grand X3 right now. And he uses the heck out of that thing. You know what I'm saying? He's mute autistic. And, you know, he flies through apps. He closes, opens, goes to YouTube, this, that, and the third. You know what I'm saying? And if a phone doesn't properly work, he's going to, he's going to, you know, he's going to have a fit. You know what I'm saying? Uh, because, you know, his mind is going at, you know, you know, almost a million miles, miles a minute. And, you know, he likes to go from here to there to there to there. So if stuff, stuff starts buffering or going slow or whatever. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to know about it. He's just going to, you know, he's going to be whining. He's going to cry or whatever. But whenever we hand him the ZT Grand X3, he loves it. He goes through apps. Boom, 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 boom. And you should see him, man. He flies through the, he flies through the, uh, the UI. He watches YouTube videos. He closes out or goes to the thing. Then he'll play a little game. You know what I'm saying? Then he'll go on, the, he'll go on the internet or something and mess around. He'll turn the phone on and off, on and off, on and off. And that thing's been working since day one. Uh, and he he abuses the heck out of it. He goes from 100% all the way down to 0%. I recharge it up all the way down to 0%. You know what I'm saying? And it's been working just fine. The battery's not bloated. You know what I'm saying? So uh, my son has a ZT Sonata 3 and the phone is great for him and his YouTube videos, bro. Nice, nice, uh, Roy. So yeah, so let me, let me tell you guys, um, you know what I'm saying? Uh, you know, phone re phone reviews and you know budget devices and everything like that uh even the twenty dollar phones the ten dollar phones the thirty dollar phones the zt sonata threes the uh alcatel streaks you know what i'm saying phones that we sell at cricket wireless you know what i'm saying obviously i work for cricket wireless but i'm not paid to say this stuff you know what i'm saying i'm not paid to say that the phones are awesome and great you should buy them you know what i'm saying if you buy a cricket wireless phone that's great but i want you to actually be here because you want to hear what I have to say, you know what I'm saying, hear me talk about the phones, maybe like my personality, the way I talk, the way I deliver my content, you know what I'm saying, and I think that, you know, Boost Mobile, Metro PCS, Cricket Wireless, most of these companies, they're not going to put out phones that are going to just go out on you, you know, within two hours, you know what I'm saying, they do have to do some quality testing, and they know that if they put a really, really, really bad phone product out there that has really, really bad glitches or battery problems or charging problems that phone's just going to come right back to them and they're going to have to you know remanufacture it. they're going to have to refurbish it they're going to have to warranty it so you know what I'm saying these phones they have a year warranty so even the cheapest phones that we sell at cricket wireless if you literally took the phone out made calls made texts take some camera shots you know what I'm saying put it in your pocket and go about your daily life you know what I'm saying and you know you didn't you didn't abuse it or overuse it or whatever like that it's gonna be fine I know people that use the cheapo phones all day long and they love it you know what I'm saying are they power users no you know what I'm saying are they people that are constantly on social media doing this that and the third and switching between apps no you know what I'm saying they're they're those people that you know go like this you know what I'm saying they don't use their thumb to navigate or anything they just pluck at the apps you know what I'm saying? They'll use one app at a time and they'll close all the apps because they know they got to do it. You know what I'm saying? They'll they'll erase stuff or whatever. And those type of people, they need phones too. You know what I'm saying? They need phones too. And they don't need a Galaxy S8 because a Galaxy S8 just does way too much. You know what I'm saying? A, a LG G6 does way too much. iPhone 7 
is way too much. And these people, you know, they work at construction. They're elderly people, so they might drop their phone a lot. Uh, you know, they might work in a, you know, a dishwasher, or greasy area, or something like that. You know, or or they might be in a fixed income and they can only afford a certain type or a certain price phone. So I think that's, you know, what I'm saying, I think even the even the cheapest phone guys at Cricket Wireless and at these other places, they have a year warranty through the manufacturer of, of defects. So, you know, you're not going to just get a phone and, you know, you're going to be like, you know, it's going to explode within two hours. You know what I'm saying? It's going to continue to work. So, you know, a lot of people that say, oh, you know, you know, the review, the, the bad phones or the cheap phones, you know, you don't talk shit about them. Why would I talk shit about them? You know what I'm saying? They're just, they're just basically phones from last year or the year before or three years ago tech. You know what I'm saying? That's in there. It's proven technology that's in these phones. You know what I'm saying? It's just more technology that's catching up. So obviously, you know what I'm saying? S8 stuff and then S7, S6, S5. So, you know, right now probably uh, stuff that we're getting now for 20 bucks, 30 bucks, you know what I'm saying, might have specs equal to the S4, the S5, the S6, you know what I'm saying, and it keeps going and going, and it's stuff that's, you know, it's stuff that, that has been used before, and that's, you know, known, you know what I'm saying, no company is going to throw, you know what I'm saying, it, now, except for rare occasions, when there's just like the shittiest phone ever, you know what I'm saying, then, you know, whatever, but I think that, you know, even the cheapo phones um, can still be put to good use, you know, even, you know, kids can use them, uh, you know, uh, like I said, kids, elderly people, and all these other people can use them. I have a person that's been with Cricket for 20 years. The most, like, you know what I'm saying? He's been with Cricket since they started, you know, um, and he, he literally breaks his phone every month. Every month, pretty much on, on cue, he comes in every month and needs a phone. You know what I'm saying? He might go two months or three months, but literally almost every month he'll come in. It's either dropped in the pool, uh, dropped out of his pocket or whatever and you know what I'm saying and I offer him the cheaper phones because I know if he gets a nice phone he's just gonna destroy it you know what I'm saying and he's a great person great man I actually uh, I have a YouTube video about him uh, we did we did a little video about him he, we, I, I called him the oldest customer in Cricket Wireless or whatever um, damn I forget his name now Mr. Dean Mr. Dean I remember Mr. Dean he came in uh, and he broke his phone he broke uh, what did he have he had the ZT Sonata 3 and he uh, actually dropped it in water, dropped it in the pool. Uh, so what did I do? I gave him a Moto, Motorola, uh, the Moto E, the Moto E that we have. Uh, you know what I'm saying? So that one has, that one has a uh, nano coating technology or waterproofing kind of. So, you know what I'm saying? And I, you know, uh, sold him a case or whatever, you know what I'm saying? Cheap case, cause the case is already, uh, you know what I'm saying? The case is already for an older phone. So the older phones, they get they get like half off discount or whatever so it's like 10 bucks or something like that for the case came with a screen protector and i was like mr dean now i gave you a phone that has nano coating and everything so you should be good you know what i'm saying but if he does break that phone he can literally still come in get like a 10 dollar phone or something like that 25 dollars for the upgrade fee so 30 35 bucks and he's he's in another phone you know what i'm saying now you know mr dean he's always oh my god i don't know what i'm doing with this new phone what what what, what, what? i'm like Come on, man. It's the same. It's the same thing. Same thing. It's just Android. You know what I'm saying? You got it. You got it. And I showed him a little bit how to work it. And I'm pretty sure he's happy with his phone right now. You know what I'm saying? I put him on the unlimited plan. So he's just been like, wow. You know what I'm saying? He's been watching. He's been watching YouTube and watching all types of stuff and doing all types of stuff with his phone. But man, it is. I tell you, man. Customers like that. Uh, you know what I'm saying? He trusts me. You know what I'm saying? He's just like, man. Just, just give me something. Just give me something. And I, I, you know, I, I try to fit the best the best of what I could and what I have available to me, you know what I'm saying, to him. So, um, and I'm, I'm, I'm hoping that this phone will last a little bit because I know Motorola and the Moto E, you know what I'm saying, has a very good, uh, uh, you know, it's pretty pretty good as far as durability wise. Uh, went with that nano coating technology with the little water resistance thing. So, hey, what's up, Manuel Rico? Uh, yeah, 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 he's been, yeah, he's been, I think he, that's what he says, you know what I'm saying? And, you know, he's been coming in religiously. He comes in every month, pays his bill, no no problems, no issues, no, like, oh, I can't pay my bill, nothing like that. He just comes in, all right, you know what time it is, bill time. He slaps his, uh, you know, 40, 50 bucks on the table, and he's ready to go. You know what I'm saying? So I've just built, and I've been working there for a year and a half, and sure enough, every month, year and a half, he'll just come in, and you know what I'm saying? And those are the type of relationships and customers that I love to, you know what I'm saying? I love to, to help out, you know what I'm saying? It's just... 
it, it's it's so great to be able to connect with people like that and help people out. You know what I'm saying? And I know what they need. You know what I'm saying? You know he'll look at the he'll look at the fancy phones and he'll just give me this look like no 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 seven hundred dollars. I'm like come on, Mr. Dean, you gonna you gonna get that phone? You gonna get that phone for uh you know that Galaxy S8 just came out six ninety nine. He'll just give me this crazy look like no nah, man, you know me. I'm like yeah yeah I know I know I know. So uh, it's just. You know what I'm saying? It's just it's just awesome, man. It's awesome. It's awesome to work in this uh, community. You know what I'm saying? Obviously, sometimes you're gonna get people. You're gonna get people that uh, Moto E is my first phone. LOL. Yeah, uh, it's got what a four inch display, three three point five four inch something like that. Three three point five four inch. I don't know which one it is, but it's got that nice round curve, so you can like kind of grip it or whatever. Uh, so yeah, so I, I I think I think he'll do good. So i I'll, I'll be happy to see him come in. And see what what happens, uh, Mr. Dang. Hey, what up, MTR? Just wanted to know, does tempered glass does anything to protect phone when applied onto your device? Uh, let me see. Uh, yes, Mr. Dang. Of course it does. Of course it does. Uh, I would say you know tempered glass is good. Uh, you know, but if you shatter your phone a lot, if you break your phone a lot, then you're going to be replacing those uh, tempered glasses a lot because the tempered glass sometimes is not even as strong as the regular glass that's under it. So. Uh, just be careful with those because you might be replacing them a lot. Uh, I would just go with a regular, I would just go with a regular, uh, regular plastic one. Uh, let me see here. I mean, I would just go with a regular, a nice regular plastic one. If you know what I'm saying, I don't use any screen protectors on any of my phones. I just use a case. That's all I got. I just got a, just got a nice little, nice little case on it or whatever. Um, you know what I'm saying? And that pretty much protects for me. You know what I'm saying? For me now, that's just for me. So because I work. You know, I pretty much work in an environment that I don't have to really be worried about uh, breaking my phone. But, you know, I mean, if you're in an environment like that, you know what I'm saying, maybe you shouldn't be pulling out your phone or you shouldn't be, you know, texting while you're trying to lift heavy machinery or equipment or you're trying to mix cement, you know what I'm saying, or you're trying to build a roof. Maybe you should have it in, in your pocket, keep it in your locker. I don't know. You know what I'm saying? That's just always been me. Like, these people, they, you know, they, they work in these really harsh environments. I don't understand why they feel like they need to be taking out their phone all the time. Maybe invest in a Bluetooth headset that uh, reads out your text messages. Most of these LG ones, LG tones, uh, you can get them for as cheap as like $40, $30, uh, 40, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70. You know what I'm saying? There's some really high priced ones like the LG Infiniums and uh, some new ones I don't even know about yet. But these things will read out your text messages. Uh, if you if you download the app, you know what I'm saying? You just hold the button, it'll read the text message out to you. Or you can download the app and you can just have one of these in your ear while you're working and you know what I'm saying it'll it'll read up text message for you you can hold this button right here and it'll tell you the time you know if you get a call coming in it'll tell you the call so you don't even have to mess with your phone you know and then maybe get like a nice um, maybe get like a nice glass kit you know glasses case or sunglasses case or maybe like a, a you know something that holds a, a, a Nintendo Game Boy you know what I'm saying Game Boy a, a 3DS or a 2DS or something like that and put it into a nice you know what I'm saying Thing and then just keep that in your pocket or keep it in your jacket pocket and then you know you shouldn't have those you shouldn't have to worry about your device getting broken on the job you know uh, or maybe keep it in a waterproof you know keep it in a, uh, a waterproof bag so I don't know um, let me see here so Ken Goody Jr. what's up what's up the Gohan Gohan I, I have to I have to acknowledge Gohan he's he's the weirdo he's the resident weirdo except for M Dust Tech M Dust Tech was my first weirdo um, uh, let's see here. LG Tone Studio. What is the app? Skeeter, Skeeter Killer Shane. What app? What app are you talking about, sir? What's the best phone to buy a cricket right now? I would have to say, personally, in my opinion, ZT Grand X4. Personally, just in my opinion, I think it's the ZT Grand X4. It's probably the best, the best bang for your buck. It's $79.99 right now. Probably, or, uh, yeah, I'd have to say that one. Uh, so what app needs your oh what app reads your text I think it's called um, let's see here let's see what um, voice alerts I used to use voice alerts I don't know if they changed it or not uh, voice alerts and then you got LG uh, let me let me I'm gonna actually look it up in the Play Store right now LG tone LG tone LG talk tone and talk here we go tone and talk supports SMS reading on Android based devices so right there LG tone and talk so you just download that right there and it will literally read your text messages and everything and tell you the time 
tell them how much battery you have remaining. All you gotta do is like hold down this button, you know, so it basically changes changes what your buttons do on your on your thing, you know what I'm saying? And it so you you just hold different things. So there you go. Uh let's see here. A pouch, yeah, pouch. Pouch is good too, you know what I'm saying? Uh you know, a little fanny pack, I guess if you want to say. Uh I've antenna. Ivan Tana and Big John Rip. Uh, I just talked to Tana Does Tech. We were actually gonna go live or whatever. He stepped out for a little bit, so he'll be he'll be uh, here soon. Uh, oh, Big John, what's up, Big John? Motorola bag phone, best bang for your buck. LOL. Hey, M Mr. MTR, what's up? What's up, man? So yeah, I was just on uh, I was just on Jay Williams uh, live chat live thing, and that, it was pretty cool, man. He was giving me some some really cool inside uh, insight. And you know he was he was on the uh, live stream or whatever it was pretty pretty dope I was enjoying being in there uh, and I forget who was in there with me but it was I think it was Ryan Thomas Ryan Thomas that was in there with me uh, yeah Big John is alive Big John is alive I I think he's been feeling sick so uh, I have a different brand Bluetooth will it work for any I believe that it will I believe that it will uh, <laughs> sup weirdo. <laughs> Yeah, man. Uh, Big John, Big John Tech Reviews, man. Feel free to call me whenever you, whenever you want, man. Uh, you know what I'm saying my phone. I, you have my phone number. It's always open, open for your for your call. You know what I'm saying. Uh, I don't. I don't think I have your phone number unless it's in the text messages somewhere. I I literally save nobody's numbers. So I have four thousand. I have four thousand uh, contacts in my phone or whatever. But like nowadays, I just text people. So if I have to look. If I have to find somebody's number, I literally look through my text messages uh, to see, you know what I'm saying, to see uh, what I text them last or whatever. So that's the way I do it. I don't know. It's weird. I know. Uh, let me see. Gohan Gaming says, laugh my ass off. Uh, Gabriel, yeah, ZTE Fridays. Yeah, ZTE, yeah, ZTE, definitely on Friday. Friday, Friday. We gonna, we gonna, we gonna, we gonna rock that. Uh, that review we're gonna do an unboxing real quick uh, you know what I'm saying I might do a live I might do a live chat review if I have somebody working with me I don't know who's working with me that day so I might go in the back and just do a live one real quick um, so yeah but yeah I'll do I'll do my usual little I'll do my usual little uh, unboxing of it first just show you guys what comes in it or whatever uh, and then you know what I'm saying I'll do the review uh, you know just the first impressions type review uh, just review of the features and functions or whatever uh, and then you know I'll, I'll wait a couple days to do like a full uh, fuller review when I you know I've gotten to play with the demo device I've sold a couple of them to people uh, you know I've set them up for people uh, let me see here MTR is about to save my contact as weirdo <laughs> Uh, let me see here. Please do a uh, comparison video between the iPhone SE and the Idol 4. Uh, I don't have any iPhone SEs at the shop. Uh, they haven't. They haven't. I don't think there's any iPhone SEs yet at the Cricut shops. I, I don't know. They haven't. I don't know if they haven't. Like they haven't uh, worked that out yet. It is online, but I, I don't have any available to me. So sorry about that. Uh, ZT Blade X Max should be coming. Uh, where has Ivan been? Haven't seen him in a few. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, how is HD on Cricut, Cricut going? Uh, I haven't really been using it because I'm using an unlocked device. I'm using the ZTZ Max from Metro PCS. So I, I don't really know. I don't really know. So I'm not really using a, a, a HD voice thing. So I've never really been interested in HD voice, to be honest, or... Or any of that, any of that uh, crystal clear voice, or whatever they want to call it on other company. I don't know. I've just never been into it. I, I make calls rarely. You know what I'm saying? I talk to the wife. Uh, you know, if the boss has to reprimand me, or or you know what I'm saying, I have to you know you know call the boss because I'm upset or something like that, or maybe a coworker. But other than that, I really don't do much phone talking. Like as far as talking, like calling people. Uh, Skype, yeah, of course, Skype and Hangouts. But calling, calling, I don't really do a lot of calls. Uh, Tana, what's up, man? I was just telling everybody, Tana is Tana. I told everybody that Tana was here, or Tan that I just talked to Tana. Uh, I thought HD voice is interoperable, right? Uh, yes and no. It's weird because my uh, 
my ZTEZ Max, if you have it on Metro PCS, you can do the HD voice, but it's unlocked, so I don't think it'll work. I haven't, I haven't had, I haven't been able to connect with HD voice uh, because it's, I don't, I don't know. I guess the bands or something like that. So yeah, I haven't been able to. Uh, okay, yes, Tana is good. I talk with him several times a day. Oh, okay, okay, Big John. Uh, yeah, you know, you know me. I'm not, I'm not that much of a talker. Uh, you know what I'm saying? I like to talk every now and again or whatever. I like to have those deep, deep convos and then, you know what I'm saying, talk every three, four, three, four days. Not every, every single day, but, uh, Tana does call me quite a bit on, uh, Skype and I love, I love that he always checks up on me, man. He always checks up on me. Uh, oh, MTR, the trip got canceled. I'm in for the night. Oh, okay. Uh, Notorious Tech Review. What the heck? Little, damn, Little John. Little John wants to go to school, guys. Little John, you want to go to school, buddy? Here, I want to show you guys. Here, let's 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 show you guys what he does. So this is Little John's harness. He gets on the bus. Uh, so I don't know why I'm gonna do this, but let's do this. All right. You want you want to get in it? You don't want to get in it. Okay, you don't want to get in it. But yeah, this is his harness. He, you know, obviously he goes on the yellow bus or whatever. And you want to, you want to go? Here. All right, come on, come on. No? Come on, come on. You want to go? All right, so this is his little harness. Actually, no, 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 no. no I'm doing it the wrong way. Doing it the wrong way. Come on. Come on, little John. You want to do it? All right, so he goes like that. And then you just, you zip it in the back, and then you're good to go. So, but little John, you're not going to school right now, buddy. So, yeah, so basically you just... It just zips in the back or whatever, and then they they uh, put him in, they strap him in the seat like that, so he doesn't go nowhere. So here you go, buddy. Hey, let me give you your Wii U. How about that? Uh, what's up, Easy Easy Computer Solutions? What's up? What's up, everybody? I I use that in my special education classes. Nice, 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 man. Yeah. Um, so yeah, guys. I mean, you know. As you guys know that Little John is, is obviously in special education or whatever. Uh, okay, so actually Little John knows how to put it on better than I do. Jesus. Okay, so there you go. Oh. Okay, so let's see. Here you go. Alright, you wanna you wanna put your school stuff on? Okay, so there you go. So let me show you guys. Let me show you guys what it looks like there. So there you go. And then you just put the straps down there at the bottom. You want the strap? You want the straps on too, buddy? See, he's telling me about the straps. He wants me to put on the straps for him, so I'm gonna put on the straps. Nope. Okay. So I'm just trying to keep him calm or whatever. So uh, he loves to go to school. I'm a special education teacher by profession, so I love what I do. Okay. Hey, Ken Goody Jr. Um, I did I did cancel that GoFundMe uh, campaign. It was just too much. Uh, people were talking, and I I didn't like the bad vibes that was coming from it. So. Uh, you told me that you had a laptop that you would like to send to me, uh, you know, whatever, you know, a one that's good. Uh, so I have an address for you. If you want to just email me, uh, I'll give you my address. Uh, and you know what I'm saying? And if you could please send that over so I can use it, I would definitely appreciate it. I would cherish it and I would use it. You know what I'm saying? I would absolutely use it for the live streaming and for the channel. Uh, so, yeah. And Easy Tech, Easy Computer Solutions, what up, man? What's going on? I've heard a lot of good things about you from Tandada's Tech. He's a, he talks he talks very good things about you. So uh, let me go let me go ahead and go to your channel right now. I literally haven't watched the video of yours yet, uh, but I will watch some videos of yours. So let me go to your channel, uh, Easy Tech Computer Solutions or Easy Computer Solutions. So there you go, buddy. I just uh, let me hit that bell too as well. So. There you go, easy, uh, easy computer solutions. You just got a subscriber, buddy. Uh, so yeah, like I said, Tana, man, Tana be telling us all about you, buddy. So he be he be telling us all about you. Yeah, I, I literally, I I'm gonna be honest and truthful with you. I haven't watched one of your videos yet. I haven't ran across any of them yet. So I guess maybe we do different genres, or you know what I'm saying. I just don't run across your videos. I haven't been, uh, I haven't been shown one of your videos in one of the things. So you know what I'm saying. Uh, and I, I do a lot of Nintendo. I, I literally watch Nintendo channels all day long. I don't really watch tech channels. Uh, so 
uh, a lot of the tech channels don't come in my, come come, in, come up in my feed. Uh, so I guess that's that. I don't know. It's it's weird. I know I do tech reviews or whatever, but I don't really watch tech channels. Uh, I I'm only subscribed to a few, uh, and I watch them like Tana, uh, Big John. Uh, you know, what I'm saying uh, Richard Tech and Games. Uh, uh, you know, I'm subscribed to Jay Williams and uh, what's his damn um, Flossie Carter. Uh, uh, you know, some of the uh, Paul Tech, CV Tech, Aloha Android stuff like that. So uh, and others like Mark McQuisition and a lot of the smaller guys that uh, are subscribed to me as well. So let's see here the pop bubble on the subject of bu budget phones. I bought the. My J7 on Home Shopping Network for the deal and phone credit along with the ability to pay for the phone. 150 phone for fall, for faller installments. That sounds like a good deal. That sounds like a good deal. So 150 bucks. 150 bucks for the whole phone and like some, some credit on there. That actually sounds like a good deal. Little John, I don't know why you want to be in this. So I guess Little John, uh, you know, I guess, you know, with this, uh, you know, with the disabled children or maybe... They have uh, autism, whatever they like to be. They like to be held, or they like to feel like security. So I guess it makes them feel secure, or whatever. Uh, I don't know. He usually doesn't have run run around with that on, but since he wants it on, why not? What's up, buddy? What's up? Now you want me to take it off? You want me to take it off? Okay. Let me take it off. Go ahead. All right. So, um, so yeah, it's just me right now and little John. So I don't have the wife to uh, take care of him or to watch him. Uh, while I'm doing this, so I have to kind of do double duty here. You know, guys, I have to do that sometimes. I have to stream and watch him at the same time, make sure he's not getting into anything. But I'm, I I appreciate your guys' patience when that do is the case. You know what I'm saying? I, I like streaming when my wife is here so she can take care of him if he, like, gets into something or whatever. But, you know, obviously, guys, family comes first. Little John comes first. Uh, the gang is here. Who's the gang? Manuel Rico, what up? Yes, it does work on me. I would absolutely love for you to use Super Chat. I accept all donations. Uh, let's see here. Let's see here. Uh, so, uh, Super Chat works. I have Patreon. I have several different little little options uh, to support my channel. Because obviously, I'm not a, I'm not a big, big, big YouTuber yet. I get a couple hundred bucks a month. And that all goes to my main little man right here, Little John. So... Uh, Forbes Text Review says just hanging out. All right, so Chris Juarez, what's up? Hey, John, I have a few questions. All right, go ahead and shoot your questions. Uh, let me see here. What did I miss? What did I miss? Did I miss anything? Uh, sandwich. That's all. What? 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 Okay. Okay. Go ahead and shoot your questions over, guys. Uh, hello, we all have tech channels here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I do, I do. I used to do gaming here and there, uh, mobile gaming. You know what I'm saying? But I kind of grew out of that a little bit. Uh, I, you know, I'll try to do something here and there. You know, or Nintendo, uh, Nintendo uh, related stuff like a, uh, the the 2DS XL drop, the Nintendo Switch drop. I try to do those because those get really am good amount of views in a short period. Uh, sometimes they're monetized by Nintendo, but they do bring in subscribers and they do bring in some views, so that helps too. So I do that too. Uh, let me see here. And I'm a big Nintendo fan, as you guys know. Uh, actually, let me see here real quick. I got a new. Let me see here. I got a new. Hold on, guys. I got a new, speaking of being a Nintendo, Nintendo nerd, so I got the, I got the, I got the green, got the green mushroom, or got the one-up mushroom, uh, these are all from McDonald's, I got the Luigi, so, uh, shoot at the screen there, boom, I got the Mario, from, this is all from McDonald's, McDonald's Happy Meals toys, uh, so, it's stupid, I know, but, yeah, I got the, I got that one, and then today, I actually got the, the red shell, I got the red shell, so, Oh man, I playing Mario Kart, man. Playing freaking Mario Kart, man. You guys know about this damn red shell. Ugh, I hated the red shell. I think we all hated the red shell, but I loved using it against people. So yeah, so that's that. But yeah, so I got the I got the little red shell today. 
It costs like I think it costs a dollar fifty or whatever to get the little toys. So I'm trying to collect them all as I can. Uh, uh, let me see here. F friends, verbiage. How much? How much RAM does the LGX Power have? It has 1.5 RAM. Is that the complete set? No, that's not the complete set. I'm missing. I'm missing Peach. I'm missing Bowser, and I'm missing. Uh, what am what else am I missing? I have Mario. I have Mario around here somewhere. I don't know where he's at at the moment because I let little John play with him. I don't just keep him in bags or anything like that. Uh, but no, that's not the complete set yet. So, uh, trying to get the little complete set. Uh, Robert Hughes says, "Hey John, tell your son that I said hi." Uh, Robert Hughes says, "Hi, little John." So, it will be great to get back using the laptop so the peanut gallery can get back into action yeah I know I know absolutely uh, we can do it over the phone but it just sounds like it sounds really bad you know what I'm saying and I know people probably don't mind but it just sounds really really bad when we do it from phone to phone what's up buddy you want me to take off you want me to take it off here I'll take it off for you okay so little John's getting a little impatient here you go okay let me get how about I get your Wii U for you let me like guys let me get Little John's Wii U for him because he really likes that. So let me get him that, and then uh, if that doesn't calm him down, then I'll have to go ahead and stop the stream right here. Here you go, buddy. Look. Play Zelda. All right. So give me one second, guys. Just taking care of Little John. So, I got him set up with his little Wii U. Uh, playing, he's going to be playing The Legend of Zelda. Hopefully that'll take care of him. Uh, whoa. <laughs> oh, man. Yes, we're here, bro. Uh, blue is the worst. I lost a legendary Pokemon from McDonald's. Had the Pokemon. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. You want, you want the thing back on, little John? No, you don't. All right, so, uh, yeah, we have we had our van our van's kind of down right now, so uh, you know he hasn't been able to be going outside uh, like he like he wants to or like he used to. Uh, so you know my wife hasn't been able to take him out. All right, buddy, you want to get back in your harness? So he wants me to put his harness back on on and off. So that's cool. That's cool. Uh, Ken Getty Jr., do you have any advice? As far as uh, autistic children, because you said that you've worked with special education. I'm trying to put it on for you, buddy. What happened? What happened? Okay, okay, okay. You want to put it on again? What happened? Uh, let me see here. He came back swinging, yeah. Yeah, he comes back swinging. He's too, he, he's, uh, he's seven years old, so he's too, he's too small to hurt me yet. But, uh, you know what I'm saying? I hate to see when he's 13, 14, 15. Uh, and... <laughs> You know what I'm saying? I don't know, man. I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to block them, block them punches. You know what I'm saying? He's just a little kid. <laughs> oh man, let me see. A little bit of everything. I like iPhone SE, 32 gigabyte from Cricket Wireless. Best price I found. Thinking about getting it soon as I can. Yeah, man. Definitely iPhone SE. I think it's a good buy. 199. Uh, let's see here. Okay. So yeah, so I'll probably just stream for a little bit more guys for you. Uh, if you guys have any real questions, concerns, comments, please leave them now. Uh, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to trying the best that I can here. I just wanted to I wanted to come on with y'all though, at least. There you go, look. There you go, you got it. Look, you got it. What you want? Now you want this part too? I got you. Alright, so I just don't want um okay, there you go, buddy. Okay. Take a run around for a little bit. All right. Uh, if you have to exchange your phone with Metro, do you get a refurbished one? You only have seven days to do that. You have seven seven days to do that. Oh, you talked about uh, insurance. Are you talking about insurance? I used to work for Metro PCS. If you the insurance, uh, possibly you get a refurbished one. Possibly. Do you have the S8 in the store? Yes, I do. Yes, I do have the S8 on the, in the store. I did a 
a little review of it. I did a couple, couple, couple things about it. Uh, Manuel Rico says someone asked me what's Redbox. What's Redbox? I want to know. Uh, let's see here. Let me see. Do you have any essay? Yeah, I have the essay. All right. So any other questions, guys? Let me know while I entertain little John. Uh, so literally, this is what we do. What happened? What happened? You gotta let me do it. You gotta let me do the back. Yeah, let me do the back. Let me do the back. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. All right. Thank you, thank you, there, Tanner. This tech. Uh, when does phone on Cricket Wireless get the update? ZT Grand X3. I don't think it will. I honestly don't think it will, man. The the X3 has been out for a while. It's actually really end of life. Uh, ZT Grand X4 is out, so I don't think it's gonna get an update. I really don't think so. Uh, do you prefer the ZT Grand X Max 2? Yes, I do prefer to. I do everything on my ZT Grand X Max 2. Uh, besides using uh, the Idol 4 for live streaming uh, and uh, you know making videos, because the camera is better on the Idol 4. Uh, but I do everything else on the ZT Grand X Max 2. Everything else, watch content. Uh, the cameras. I mean, the battery lasts a long time. So. All right, guys. Well, I'm going to have to go ahead and get out of here. So thank you guys for watching and, and jumping in on here. Uh, and so, yeah, hopefully I, I uh, answered I answered your questions. Hopefully, you know what I'm saying, the title was great. But like you see, guys, I'm, I'm pretty busy with the little John over here. And I don't want to get smacked by a metal harness here because I'm not paying attention. Oh, man. All right, little John. Here, let me do this one. All right, let me see. Ah, I gotta do this real quick. Oh man. Okay. There you go. There you go. You gotta give me a second. All right. So, boom. Yeah. I don't want to. I don't want to get. Uh, I don't want to get smacked by a metal harness because I'm not paying attention. That would suck. To have a metal, get a freaking little, get a black eye because of a metal harness, metal piece. Don't think th those uh, those uh, rings on them thing is pretty serious. All right. All right, so, oh, MTR, my, M, okay, all right, so I'll see you guys. Hey, little John, come say bye. Ah, he left. All right, so anyways, peace out from the Magic Tech Review family over here. Thank you guys for stopping in, and I will see you guys. Peace out. Uh, MTR, okay, the Granite Studio did get the update back in December. Cool, man. Uh, Big John Tech Reviews, you should do a video if you still have your Grand X3 about it, about the update. And there goes the... Little John, he's, I swear. The camera loves him, but he won't get on the camera. All right. Peace out, bro. Okay, so. All right, let's see. Peace out. All right, all right. Yeah, man. Sorry, guys, about the short stream. Hopefully, my wife will be here tomorrow, and I'll be able to stream long, longer or whatever. But, yeah, I, I think we, I think we, I think we did, uh, I think we did enough. Single life. What phone do you, what phone, what do you mean? Uh, is ZT Sonata 3 better than the Samsung Galaxy Amp 2. Uh, that's all preference. Samsung Galaxy Amp 2 has a AMOLED screen. ZT Sonata 3 does not. ZT Sonata 3 is a 5 inch phone. Uh, Samsung Galaxy Amp 2 is a 4.5 inch phone. So Samsung Galaxy Amp 2 is more vibrant. The camera's a little bit better. Uh, so it's all about preference really. Smaller, better quality, bigger, you know what I'm saying? Less quality. It's all about what you what you want. Uh, let's see here. I'll stay on here for just a little bit longer. So I think little John's in there now chilling. So once he gets his mind occupied on something, he's fine. But it's like, yeah, see? I don't know. But he really does enjoy, he really does enjoy our time together. So let me let you guys go because, yeah, he's going to come whiny, whiny. So love you guys. Peace out. And we'll see you guys tomorrow. What phone you use? Uh... Uh, camera, camera is going to be Samsung Galaxy Amp 2, better camera. Weirdo Tech Reviews, what's up? Oh, God. That. <laughs> Your profile picture's weird. Peace out. Bye, bye, bye.